Bachata Knight here, and I have a very special package to unbox today. It is from Medieval Extreme. And why do I have armor on to do it? Because I'm going to try this right out of the box. This is the Titanium Buckler. So we're going to unbox it right now real quick. Uh, I'll get some measurements and stuff, and maybe an official weight after... Uh, we'll, we'll cut the video and I'll go home and I'll I'll do that at home with my armor off. But we are going to take this right out of the box. I want to see how it feels. All right. I'm doing it here in the bright sunshine because it's probably going to be shiny. Mace. You know, I can't just order one thing. Oh, man, is it bright. This is the titanium, and it is light. That's why. That's why I should comment on. It is light and bright. Oh man, this is awesome. So this is going to be what I'm going to use for things like pro fights. I got to watch because there's that leather strap there. All right. Wow, this is great. Oh my god, is this light. <clears throat> Mace. Try it again. All right. Check this out. So here we go. Man. I mean, I almost feel like I have nothing on my hand. I have hourglass gauntlets, so this does not sit exactly flat, and it's never going to, because... Can you see that there? That part of the gauntlet, you know, it's fixed, it doesn't move, it's the shape of my gauntlet. But... Can you see it in the light? Oh, glorious! This is so light. You can see the lip on here. So for a comparison, see now it's fitting flat, you know, with this, this suede glove I have, which is actually what I usually use when I fight Buckler. But uh, there you go, so now it's more lined up on the edge. So, uh, if you have hourglass gauntlets, remember, as you probably know already, a center grip shield with hourglass gauntlets, uh, a lot of times you're going to have an issue with it lining up exactly with where you're trying to throw a horizontal punch. But, uh, but alright, so let's take this home and check it out. We'll get some measurements. Now we're going to check this out. Really, up close, you can see the details here. Always fine workmanship by this company, Medieval Extreme. You're wondering about the weight, as I'm sure it's what everyone is wondering about. A dinner plate is lighter than titanium buckler. But this thing is very light. And to show you, I have a scale. It is just over a kilogram. So just over a kilogram here. Oh, I'll uh, show you the back up close, because, you know, outside is a little bright, and I was already sweating in that armor. Metal handle, which is allowed for a buckler. Yeah, I'm sure you know that, but just in case you don't. Wrapped metal handle inside. Outside, as you can see, there's that lip where it's folded over. Of course, you have to have an edge on these things. Uh, juice made in Armenia, baby. All right, I'm going to get a close look at this buckler, uh, I mean this mace, because I'm going to show you right through that hole is where I'm going to put this. Uh, Medieval Extreme always has the coolest pictures, uh, for gra like picture graphic stickers. I'm actually going to give these here to my daughter. Uh, I'll probably save that one there. But she loves her stickers probably more than I do. Of course, you get your note envelope. I'm going to put this through there. This is actually really nice. Uh, you know, it's 
it's a sad situation, but also this is gonna go right through that hole, but I can't tie it with just one hand. And actually, let me show you something. All right, because, I mean, you might not know this. Here's a tip of the day. So if you do have an hourglass gauntlet and you want something to sit flat, put a block of wood behind where your knuckles are. So when you're holding the strap, the leather strap, come on, I can't go fast enough while I'm making a video. See, that corrects it. So when you're gripping this, block of wood there, keeps this even. Shield will be even, not on an angle like you saw in this video with the buckler. Block of wood behind where the knuckles go flattens out an hourglass gauntlet for something like a punch shield. And there you go. Uh, that in inches equals about 35 centimeters. I was wrong. I bought the 35 centimeter shield, which is about HMB max limit. So, uh, you yeah, know, have much else to say. Titanium buckler from Medieval Extreme. So I guess it's a short video. Uh, of course, if you keep watching videos on this channel, one day you're going to see me punch somebody with it. Then we'll get an actual review of it in use. So uh, did you notice I have a microphone now? So I hope these reviews are a little bit better because no matter if I'm far away from the phone or close to it with it up in my mouth, you will still hear my voice just the same. So I hope that's an improvement for everybody because I do review a lot of armored uh, fighting products in this channel. So like the video, if it helped you out, any questions, drop them below. I pretty much answer everything within a day or two. And I uh, will catch you next video, everybody. I hope you enjoyed and maybe even check out this titanium buckler made by Medieval Extreme.